Hey Hornets, it's Mrs. Betts. Today we're gonna work on animal balance. So for this activity, you're going to need a stuffed animal. Go ahead and get your stuffed animal now. Okay, so what did you choose for your stuffed animal? Oh, Miss uh, Coach Leopard's got a ladybug, look at that. Okay, so today we're going to practice balancing our stuffed animal on different parts of the body. Okay, first go ahead and balance it on your hand. Okay, now turn your hand over and balance it on the top part of your hand. Okay, try balancing it on your shoulder. Stay ladybug, stay. Good job. Okay, how about balancing it on your leg? You can either lift it up or you can kneel down and put it on your leg. And if the animal falls off, it's okay. Just pick it up and keep going. Good job. How about, can you balance it on your back? You may need to get down on the ground to do this. Good job. All right, now stand up. Can you balance it on your elbow? It's staying. How about on your foot? Either off the ground or just on your toe. <laughs> it's staying. All right. How about balancing it on your head? Good job. We balanced the ladybug on all parts of the body. Now let's see if you can do a plank and balance the ladybug. Good job, the ladybug's hanging out on Coach Leopard's back. How about getting crab walk position? Can you balance your animal on your tummy? Good job. Okay, now stand up and we're going to see if you can jump over your stuffed animal. Carefully, be aware of the space around you. So jump with two feet, turn around, try it again. How many times can you jump over your stuffed animal? Job. Okay, now let's see if we can hop over your stuffed animal. Remember, hopping is with one foot. Be careful. All right, good job, Hornets. <laughs> 